This exercise is all about getting some length through the outside of the hip to later help it engage better. So in a standing position with the feet kind of shoulder width apart, essentially what we want to start with is getting some differentiation between how the spine moves and how the pelvis moves. So in a standing position, if I bend my spine this way and that way, notice how my hips haven't changed at all. It's purely spine moving. So first, just get used to that. And then keeping the spine more steady, this time I'm gonna move my hip outside the line of my foot. And you can see the difference. Now my hip has changed position and my spine has to follow. Whereas before, if I was purely spine, it was this motion. And so we want to get used to actually shifting the pelvis across. You'll feel now more weight in this foot, although we want to make sure that the other one still stays planted on the ground. And you should get a really big stretch on the outside of the leg there. We want to accentuate that as much as possible. And so with the opposite arm, as we shift out over that side, we want to reach as far as we can, like a teapot, as far over as possible, allowing this spine also to drop down. So over to that position, and you'll get a huge lengthening down through that side. Because what we know is the better length we can create through a muscle, like an elastic band, if I force that to stretch enough, the nervous system will have to make it kick back in to start working once again. So from the other side, as I shift my pelvis across as far as it can, I can go, reach into the other side, bending the spine, weight now all in my right foot. You might also get the opposite groin and over there moving. But what I don't want to see is if you are to show you side on, is as you do that movement, I don't want to see you collapsing down. It needs to be more of a pure sideways motion. And the idea is to work through this really slowly, 30 seconds to a minute, just slowly feeling the movement, getting the length. It's not a stretch, it's the movement and back. And the same in the other direction.